This is the fourth generation Acura TL, which launched for model year 2009 and is due to be replaced soon with a new fifth generation machine. So it's not the freshest or newest model in its segment, though it is one of the most established. And since this TL generation launched, I've driven it numerous times. Over the year, me and Acura's popular sports sedan have spent countless hours and miles together. Why? Well, I like driving this car somewhat regularly. It helps put the affordable sports sedan scene into perspective because it's one of those machines that delivers great dynamics, value, and engineering at a decent price. It's an important car for the brand, too. It was the first Acura model to push past the 300 horsepower mark, one of the first to bring super handling all-wheel drive technology into the mainstream, and one of the first cars at its price point to pack such a lengthy list of top-shelf features to like a full multimedia system, push-button start, reverse camera, climate-controlled seats, blind spot monitoring, and more. And it did all of this with two things that shoppers love. One, an honest price tag, and two, a promise of reliable, no-nonsense ownership thanks to Acura's gleaming reputation for reliability. Being a highly usable sedan has helped this TL establish itself too. There's generous room for four adults, and up front, a high-tech, very three-dimensional looking instrument cluster and control layout, a great thick and sporty steering wheel, plenty of at-hand storage, and a set of proper cup holders. And all you get, very unique styling that very much does its own thing, while creating a distinctively upscale, techy atmosphere. But I've always been more excited by the TL's driving experience. Up here, you get a 3.7-liter VTEC V6. That's got 305 horsepower. Not packed leading, but the engine is very pleasing to listen to and really piles on the juice at high revs as the VTEC power cam kicks in. Six-speed automatic works well with the engine for smoothness and response, supporting a sporty but very refined character, and you can get a six-speed manual transmission if you like. Then there's the super handling all-wheel drive system, which is my favorite. And the reason it's my favorite all-wheel drive system is because it gives you both a sense of locked-on confident traction in bad weather and a sense of playful agility when you get to driving it hard. On snow and ice, those electromagnetic clutch packs can instantly send power 70-30 either axle, but when you get to driving it hard, it sends more power to the rear and then it can accelerate the outside wheel into a corner, which makes the back end feel lighter and more playful. It makes this thing feel like a lightweight rear-wheel drive sports sedan, which is awesome. That's all directed by a heavy set steering system that confidently transmits a sense of agility and playfulness to the driver too. End of the day, few sedans are this all out confident and discreetly entertaining when pushed hard. Powerful and fairly communicative brakes back up the performance capabilities and when you're on a relaxing drive, wind and road noise levels are kept adequately in check. So is fuel consumption. This engine might not have all of the latest fuel saving gadgets, but I still averaged under 10 liters per 100 clicks over the course of a week. Take all of that to mean that the TL is one of those cars that's beautiful to drive on the highway, on the back roads, through a snowstorm, on a handling course, or just about anywhere else. Other notes, the Xenon projector lights are fantastic, and the big doors and big comfy seats make this an easy car to get in and out of, even many times per day. Complaints? Well, I hope the new TL has a bit more punch from the stereo, a more responsive paddle shift mode, a more logical central control layout, and a set of folding rear seats for handling larger cargo. But I pretty much hope they keep the powertrain just how it is. The new TL has yet to be seen, but for the time being, if you like a car that's discreetly sporty, offers a proven reputation, delivers plenty of character, and has a pleasing overall driving experience, you'll probably like this TL as much as I do. Pricing starts around 40 with front wheel drive and 44 with a super handling all wheel drive. Thanks for watching.